Welcome to another night of hockey. Alongside Eddie Olchek, I'm Mike Emmerich. We'll hear from Ray Ferraro shortly. This should be a special night inside this arena. Tonight, we bring you a matchup between two great teams. The contest tonight between Vegas and the Pittsburgh Penguins. And before the faceoff, here's Eddie. Well, we have two teams that are intense, Doc, and they don't like each other very much, so stay tuned. I expect some fireworks here tonight. And the game has started. What a wonderful matchup this one is. It goes back years. Score! Didn't take long for the home team, did it? Presence of mind to get to the front of the net, open up, and one time it didn't pass the goaltender. The goaltender's got to guess whether there's going to be a shot after this great move, but he can't catch up to the pass. The Golden Knights strike first. Just like the coach drew it up, get off to a good start. And that's a face-off win. Vegas, in their own end, has possession. One team is going to be short from this. Let's see what the call is. Pittsburgh's roster goes down by one here. At least briefly, a minor penalty for hooking. Oh, this is not a good penalty. A lazy penalty behind the play, reaching in, turning the stick over, and hooking the player. There's always a start to your power play night, and this is number one. Pittsburgh penalty to the Penguins with a face-off win. Sent on further, they'll have to return. The Golden Knights carrying it on in neutral ice. Pop loose, denied by the defense. Shot on. You can almost count that one, but no, what a save. Back and forth they go between the points. Score! A power play goal, and it's a biggie. had the feeling, Ray, that there was going to be a goal coming, but the way that they were skating and pressuring and supporting all over the ice, you knew the puck was going to end up in the back of the net. Now the goaltender wants to be aggressive here, but this is just perfectly delivered. A little under three minutes gone. Just recently another goal, and so the lead is two. Pittsburgh's got it off the draw at center. Gets that one on a cross. Oh, big rebound here. One-timer. Oh, what a terrific save in close. A missed opportunity from this close in. Vegas can't expect another save like the one we just saw. Their goaltender came up large to bail them out. Good job tying the man up on the faceoff. Teammate comes in. Propelled to Smith. On to Perron. Laid on, but he's all alone! And so now a penalty will be handed out. The Penguins have accrued a penalty. It's a minor for slashing. Oh, look at the reaction of the puck carrier. He is in some pain. That's a slash. Anything you do once, you can do twice. Let's see if that applies to this particular power play. It's for penalty. Big face-off win. Lightning in that glove. Buck covered. Whistle blown. Murray's positioning allows him to make that stop. That's a difficult one because the puck was delivered with a lot on it. Defensive zone win. Carrying the puck in the neutral zone. And he dumps it in. Chip to Neal. Nicely into the zone. Knocked right off the stick. 
He drops on back further. What do you think he's thinking? Flings it. Score! Morgan! the puck there it keeps the goaltender honest he doesn't know what you're gonna do this is a great move the way that he moves the puck from side to side the goalie eventually bites on the deep and then he puts it in the penguins gotten this back to a close one they needed this one they were not playing very well to this point they win the draw and will now set up an attack. By number 71, Evgeny Malkin, assisted by Moves to the corner. By number 30, Matt In the slot. Great save. 56 seconds. Pittsburgh's gotten back even. Penalty kill. Well, you can't expect to score every time on the power play, but you would like to generate a few more chances than they did on this last one. They were good early in the game. They were able to be successful with the power play, but this one wasn't very good. Great opportunity, but the pass didn't connect. Off the goal post. Puck loose, knocked down to a knee. And it's napped by Kessel. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a faceoff right near him. There's not many saves easier than this for the goaltender. He gets his blocker on it, he's in good position, and he deflects this away. Clean win on the draw. Pittsburgh setting things up in the defensive zone. Looking to Crosby. Directing that one to Kessel. He is shut right off. He's certainly on a mission out there. He's trying to set a tone for his team in what should be a really physical contest. Still has control up the wing. Knocked off the puck. This takes a lot out of him. That one is pointed to him. Gathered in by Hornquist. Pass attempt to Smith. Vegas looking to wheel it up the wing. Nice move to shake on through. Forcing attention in deep. Wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. Skates out with it. Forks it to Garrison. The Penguins control the play at center. And that one went offside. I don't know how much of this puck he stopped, guys, but it was just enough to keep it out of the net. Face-off win. Let's see what develops. Wow, that's got a... Okay, so we got a guy hurt here, and it looks like a fight's gonna start. And that is one way to respond after you have an injured teammate. These two teams get together. You can expect the game to run a little hot. Both of these guys feel the heat. The crowd is on their feet, and they're trying to give their teams a little spark. Nothing new, a fight between these two teams, and this one is over. That's why we love rivalry hockey, nothing better. Well, these guys will have five minutes to get back dressed and get ready to go again at some point. Got possession. Snapping a pass to Crosby. Let's a shot go. He got his glove on that one. Solid clean win. Taken away. Let's it go. Puck covered, whistle blow. I don't 
don't know if he's going to make a save much easier than that one. He's in good position. It's a rather routine stop. The Penguins win the draw. Fires a shot. Twenty minutes have been played. Both teams had some success. Hockey's narrowest lead is what we have here. One goal. Do you know someone in your community who goes the extra mile to help out? Nominations for our team player awards are available in the golf course in the lower seating level. The Golden Knights are holding on to a lead, and it's saves like this one that have kept them there. We'll be right back. We are in the early stages of this game, about to begin the second period. Your thoughts on the first? The Penguins are down in this game, Doc, and rightfully so. They did not manage the puck at all. If they want to get back in that game, they got to eliminate those turnovers. Middle period has just begun. Little pass that can start some progress ahead. Using the point, he's got it. Taken over now by Hornquist. That's a good, solid poke check. Two guys together with force. Big force. I wonder if that hit will change the momentum of this game. Snaps a shot. Vegas moves with it up the wing. Let's a shot fly. Blocker it away. Karam pass to Garrison. To Hornquist. Up the wing, making some headway. Right to the point. Ah, oh, you should have done better on that pass. Now everybody has to go back to center ice and get ready again. Hammered. Ball score. And this one is tied. First shot was stopped. He stayed with it and he put in his own rebound. Fleury's trying to cover the bottom of the net, but the puck beats him anyway. The Penguins have even the game here. Still in the second period, anybody's game now. Solid win at center ice. Now what? Gets in, looks over his options here. And by number four, Let's it go. Six minutes, 41 seconds. The Golden Knights continue to probe up the wing. Fires outstanding save. What magic even to get there and get the shot off. Over nine minutes off the clock. We are at two goals apiece. Good clean win on the draw. Tumbled to one knee and he lost it. The Penguins look to make a difference up the wing. A shot, terrific shot, but a great point blank save. A quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. Nicely received at the point. He throws it there. Puck loose, good defensive play. Tries to get it on net. He scores! Second of the game. What a performance. Smith's quick hands allowed him to snap that one off and score the goal. The butterflies become a default position for the goaltender, Enzo. And while the shot is nice, he's down in that butterfly position way too quickly. Vegas has grabbed the lead here by just a single goal. So let's see who wins this next faceoff, and maybe a goal can come from it. Solid work defensively by Carlson. Through the corner. Takes that pass from the other point man. Gives it to the point. 
seeks the corner. Puts one on. And another glove save. And that whistle will give them relief for the moment. Fleury's quick thinking allowed him to stop the play to slow down the pressure. Beat him on that one. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Carrying it in center ice. Shoots one. A lightning light glove save. A little under three minutes to go. We had a tie game until just moments ago. It's a one goal contest. The Penguins with a clean win on the draw. Pittsburgh's up the wing, controlling play now. In the slot, score! And the game is even. If you really think about it, at some point, the puck's got to get through the middle of the ice. The area in between the two face-off dots, if you get there, you're going to get rewarded. A lot of times the goaltender feels like his positioning is perfect and he's got the net covered. Guess what? He doesn't. The Penguins have gotten this game tied. Can they break it before the end of this second period? And they take that neutral zone faceoff. The drama heightens in this final minute of the second period. The battle for the puck and he can't get free. The Golden Knights are controlling in their own end. We've played two periods here of a three-period game. The best part of the day is coming up. Join us for our next team practice, which will be open to the public. Admission is simply by donation, with all proceeds going to local charities. Pittsburgh's got the strength going into this next period on the heels of the goal they scored late in this one that tied it. We'll be right back. Third period underway, tie score. A shot, that one's deflected. Attack zone possession here. And he sends it to the net. That shot came from nowhere. Uh, with this puck being so close to net, this is all a reactionary save. Nice face-off work. Trying to go to Crosby. Gains the blue line. Using the point. Vegas leaves its own end. Loose puck, the defense got in the way there. Looks from the corner. To Crosby. Smith's likely to score again. He's been all over the ice. Score! Thankfully, that shot did not hit the goaltender because that thing was labeled. The speed of this is too much for the goalie, Eddie. He's in position. He just can't catch up to it. Penguins have broken the tie here in the third period. So what will be their philosophy now? We'll probably see it from this opening faceoff. Moving it to Latang. Sidney Crosby assisted by number 72, Patrick Hornfield. Gains the zone and looks over his options. Five minutes, 29. Shoots. Score! Phil Castle.
get this close to the goaltender, the puck on your stick, you got to snap it quick. He just wasn't able to get over and cover the top of the net. The shot's perfect. It's right in the roof, and the goalie's dejected. A little under seven minutes have gone by. Just recently, another goal, and so the lead is two. Tie up and help from the winger. Knocked it away with the stick. Nicely into the zone. He lost it down to a knee. That puck's loose because of the defense. To Hagelin. Carries through center on the wing. Perfect receipt of the pass. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. Snaps a wrister. What a save. This is an easy game to comment on because it's been nothing but goals, goals, goals. There's not been many saves to talk about. The goaltenders have had a difficult night defensively. They haven't had much help either as both teams are filling the net. Good work with the stick. A shot. Terrific challenge. Outstanding save. They have just four players on the ice. Their fifth is slow to his feet and back to the bench. He's hurt. A whistle and a rest. Guys, bone jarring hit here. He was hurt immediately. Job on the draw. Slid to Carlson. And he steps in. A shot. Missed. Shoots it off. Waffle boarded. The Penguins ready an attack back in the defensive zone. Pitching this one to Latang. Passing one off now to Kunako. Good defensive work there. Oh, and he is drilled. McNabb's always been a leader for his club, and now he's trying to push the rock up the hill as they get themselves back to within level striking distance. Goalie is gone. Extra man coming on. Now it's directed to Kessel. Net empty. Great chance, but he missed. Propelled to Merrill. The Golden Knights up the wing, locked the puck. And angled to Neal. Carried to the corner boards by Smith. Back to the point. Looking from the blue line. Loose puck knocked away by Crosby. Treasure is intense. Who can get it out of there? Ten seconds to go. Gets in, and he'll look over his options. And that's it. The game is over. Tonight, it was a power play fest. Usually, somebody loses that because of their special teams play, and that's what happened. Need to have better passing, better reception, and better support on those loose pucks. So the teams have left the ice and are getting rested for next time. For this time, for Eddie and Ray, Mike Emmerich saying good night.